four of us in one. The man accused of shooting his mother in the head on New Year's Eve was brought to court for his bond hearing in a wheelchair. It's unclear why. Alexei Sadiq is being held on $1 million cash bond. He was impassive as Judge Jason Nagel heard how police found an ounce of meth, acid, some other drugs, and marijuana in the home, where his 62-year-old mother, Tashiana Romanova, was found lying in the doorway, critically wounded. Miami Township police figured something like this could happen. We felt like that uh, for the last week. Chief Mike Mills says they were at the home, sometimes with crisis intervention, five times in the last two weeks sat and talked with Sadiq for hours. He'd either clear a 72-hour hold or his mother would send them away. Our hands were tied. We, we couldn't get her to leave. We couldn't, we didn't have anything to um, secure him on. 12 days before the shooting, police brought him to Mercy Hospital for a mental health evaluation. A paramedic who was injured later described how Sadiq burst into anger, flinging computers to the floor. Stating to police, martial arts made him realize two people respect one another more after they fight. He was released the next day after posting $2,000 cash bond. Police pointed out most of the 911 runs were because of calls from him. Because of his drug intoxication, he thinks people are trying to come in the house and get him or trying to climb in the windows or uh, having him under surveillance. Police were at the home hours before the shooting. The chief says his mother assured them he won't shoot me. Chief Mills tells us tonight the mother remains in critical condition, hospitalized, stable, we are told. It would take 100 grand cash, 10% of the million, to free Sadiq, who the chief believes was influenced by mind-altering drugs. Live in Claremont County, John London, WLWT News 5.